The endangerment of the Kemp sea turtle is an important issue due to its connection with our public beaches. Kemp turtles are highly dependent on the land for survival, and us as humans are the sole reason behind their endangerment. The nesting habits of the Kemp Ridley turtle make them more susceptible to harm by humans. New human developments, such as coastal construction on our beaches, are large threats to nesting females and their hatchlings. In addition to hunting and killing of these animals for food and decor, harmful fishing gear, collision with recreational boats, and balloons that end up in the ocean also contribute to the Kemp turtle's susceptibility. Hey there, we're on the streets of Austin to get more information on how much the public knows about the Kemp Ridley sea turtle. If a Kemp Ridley sea turtle lays 110 eggs on the beach, how many of those eggs are expected to live to adulthood? I am going to guess five. Five. It's even less than that. Three eggs at 110. Maybe like 50? Uh, how about three? I have no idea. Why are Kemp Ridley sea turtles hunted by human beings? Uh, are they tasty? They are tasty indeed. Would you consider uh, sea turtles endangered? No, I don't think so. Did you know that they're actually critically endangered? I did not. All sea turtles play an important role in keeping our oceans healthy, but the Camp Ridley is especially important to us Texans since they farm seagrasses in the Gulf. They basically give the coast a healthy haircut, and without this haircut, the plants would overgrow and cause low oxygen levels, obstructed currents, and slime molds, which destroy homes and foods for all of us. Only three out of every 110 sea turtles are expected to make it to adulthood in the wild. Three, these animals have enough competition as it is without humans getting involved. And once they reach adulthood, we hunt them for food and boot material. They're only endangered because they have been hunted by humans for so long. It's our duty to restore these animals to their natural place in the ecosystem. Spill prevention is just one important step for protecting sea turtles, as well as ensuring that our beaches and waterways are free of trash such as plastic that can entangle them or cause choking when they mistake it for food. Many turtles that do survive to adulthood die when caught unintentionally in shrimp trawls and fishing gear. That's why the NOAA is helping make sure that shrimpers have access to TEDs that keep turtles from getting caught in trawls. They need our help to survive, so when you see any nesting sea turtles, turtle eggs, or hatchlings on the beach, don't disturb them. Call the turtle hotline at 1-866-TURTLE-5.